I think you guys are our people. Hey guys! Hi. Hello. <laughs> We're your people. Yeah. How are you? You're the only one with camera crews around. Good. I guess we can't really. I know. Elbow, air hug, you know what I'm saying? Get, yeah. COVID, hey. It's all right. We've all been tested. Yeah. How are you doing? How are you feeling? Good, for the most part. Yeah, we found out this one was a girl, and I for sure thought it'd be a I boy. know, like, it's, it's our one, last like, one. Come on. It. How long have you guys been down here now? Six, Six months. Yeah, Happy since year. October. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I actually moved without him. Like, we were going through some problems. But how do you feel? Because, like, she moves down here, you know, and then eventually you were like, wow, f I'm going. We kind of, like, had a freak out moment. Like, okay, I'm doing this. <laughs> and then, like, oh, wait, wait, we don't want to live without each other. And didn't you guys, like, go through a separation? We did. Yeah, I was pregnant with Beta, so it was like two and a half. Didn't work years out very ago. well because I kept calling. Me. No, he would always come and spend the night. <laughs> and I was just like, I thought you were the one that wanted this, yeah. you know? But being high school sweethearts isn't the. I don't feel like it's as glorious as people make it out to. Like, oh, you've been together since you're 16, and then you're like, oh yeah, we have. The thing is, too, is like when you're young and you're together and you grow up together, there's things, you, you grow and you change as you grow older. Mm -hmm. So yeah, of course yeah. you're gonna have bumpy roads and sh crap that you go through, you know? Well, I think like, you either not... grow together or you kind of grow apart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And well, how long are you guys together before you got pregnant? Not long, half well, a year. Yeah, it's not a long time, mm -hmm. especially at 16. And <laughs> we were just teenagers being stupid, yeah. weren't we? Yeah, yeah. weren't like... we all? <laughs> <laughs> If we didn't place Carly, we don't know if we would even you be know. together. We went through a lot. A lot. You guys have, I'm sure, after your yeah. first born, like we've been through a lot of junk. Well, two individuals working on themselves can make, oh my God, a huge difference. A so huge much, difference. Yeah. We noticed that like self-care is super, super oh, yeah. important. Like it makes you a better parent. It really does. People get confused with being selfish. Like, no, it ain't being selfish. I I just started uh, ketamine therapy recently, and that's been great because you know you get a shot of ketamine and then you just meditate for an hour and a half, and you go through this healing process of like the therapist really works with you and all that stuff. So like, I don't know, I, I kind of go when I feel like I need it. Ketamine therapy. Ketamine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. But the kids are loving it here. Yes. And stuff. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. good. I mean, we're having problems with the youngest, but he's like been hitting his teacher, Oops. mainly on the butt. <laughs> no. He's just. Yeah. <laughs> My whole school life was just, I was always suspended, expelled, kicked out <laughs> in the office, like all the time. So I just feel like kids are hyper. <laughs> I think you're kind of blessed in a way of like, you can take him and kind of maybe channel that into mm -hmm. something. I'm at the beach the other day and Bronx is doing the perfect cartwheel. Get him out of He might kill it. Like I've been telling her, you know, you take a boy that hasn't been in school because he's never even been in school since we got here. Right. And so you throw him into a classroom with, you know, 15, 20 other kids that he don't know. You know, he has, he has some behavior that needs to be dealt with. Mm -hmm. Did the youngest just start acting out like just when you guys moved here? He's always advanced slower than the other He's kids slower. his age. Uh -huh. Everything, walking, talking. You know, Nova was saying so many words at two, like yeah. really conversations. Veda's not. And at first I got worried and I was like, you know what, Caitlin, like all kids go at their own pace. Okay. Do you notice a difference if you're just with him by himself or, you know what I mean, between oh, mom yeah. and dad, like the behavior differences? Yeah, all of our kids, like when they're around me, they're totally different than when they're around her. You <laughs> Isn't know that crazy? Yeah. Curse. It's the mom <laughs> curse, man. You guys come in and you just like, it's like taxify and the kids start mm -hmm. going crazy. It's dumb, but you know, that's all about being a parent is to trying to figure it out, it's right? Where every single day <laughs> yeah. is a door to grow. Uh -huh. It's an open door to grow. And... You have like a plastic cup and some napkins or something? Uh, I do have some napkins, yes. I use plastic cup. Josh has a napkin. I just need a spit. Gotcha. I also give myself a lot of blame because in a way the kids lost their mom for a whole year. I understand the guilt. I mean, I was, I was sleeping until mm -hmm. noon, and they would just kind of wake up and do their own thing. I understand where you're coming from, though, because I honestly just said this to Tyler yesterday. Watching Nova, I was like, you know, like, it still sometimes makes me sad for all the stuff that I put her through when she was so young. I mean, just in her six years of life, her mom has been to treatment three times. Mm -hmm. And I think I'll probably always have that little piece of guilt, but also I try to live every day now, like, you know, super involved. Like you're saying, like, I make sure I'm there, I show consistency. But the guilt sucks sometimes. Mm -hmm. Okay, a, so we should probably go. My grandpa said, 
Beta had a little tumble off the sofa, but she seems oh. to be fine now. She just cried and I rubbed the back of her head. We are wondering how long it'll take you to get here. I guess we all need to get back to our kids. How long until they're 18? <laughs> 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 Give me the kisses. Yay, puppy! Give mommy good sugars. No, like this. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday! Yay! <laughs> I love my baby.